Well, of course, we're going to be doing a little bit of juice here. Let's see here. But you know, sometimes you just feel the need to re-wick before you do such things. Now, once the juice burns off of both sides, then they glow uh, quite nicely. Okay? Now, what we got here is Higgy's Mango Splash. Alright? And this is something I do when I'm re-wicking. It just cools the coil down a little bit faster, so I'm not going to burn my cotton. Add a little bit of juice to it. All is right in the world. I heard a squeal outside and then a dog barked. That can't be good. That can't be good. Wow, you use a awfully long piece, don't you? Now I did, you can't see it, but I did take those little sheets off the sides. You know, the hard pressed part of the Japanese cotton. I do take that off. Most people would lock their mods also. As you can see, I didn't. Okay. And it's just a sheet of Japanese cotton that I ripped some off of. Alright. Alright. Let's see. Go a little bit more. Let's go a little bit more. Don't put your finger on the button and you don't have to worry about much. Let's uh, make that one short. Let's uh, make this one short. And then we just have those little bits left over. Little bits, little bits, little bits. We like little bits. I just... You can't see what I'm doing, but I just fold that one under. I grab this one, curl it, tuck it in, do the same thing on the other side, starting from the same side. What? Kids are playing video games. That's what kids do at summer break. Okay, we have all this nice, bluffy cotton. Well, that's not part of the review process, is it? Well, of course it is. I don't do this for everything when I make a video, but I thought, why not? I'll show you guys that I can do it. I do do it sometimes. I do try these in fresh builds. I do try these in whatever tank I can get to wick certain juices. If I can't get them to wick in a tank, then of course I'm just going to drip them. But it is what it is, man. A little bit of ramp up time when it's ice cold. But chain vaping it keeps it nice and warm. Clapton's, baby. You gotta love Clapton's. Now, let's see here. Fuzzy everywhere. Fuzzy everywhere. Stick it down on there. We're still good. And we're back up top. Higgy's Mango Splash. So when David brought home, David got mentioned, the new Cranberry Mango Fruit Juice by Ocean Spray. Jen couldn't stop bragging about it during her webcast. So of course, we had to make a vape of it. Mango, cranberry, and apple make this a sweet, fruity, refreshing vape sure to hold up to any hot summer day. I think I need more in there. Let's just pour some in there. Why not? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Alright, bottle, child proof. Okay, and it works. And it works, and it works. Higgy's Mango Splash. 1.5 milligram, 25 PG, 75 BG, 12 milliliter bottle. Yeah, 12, not 10, 12. All right. Let's see here. Born on date. Shake well before use. Store in a cool, dry place. For use in e-cigarettes and vaporizers. 
Do not ingest. Keep out of the reach of children and animals, especially the cute ones. You gotta love those little, those little touches. Little touches. Nice bottle. All right. Put that off to the side. Babe, some more. Baby, baby, baby. Mm. It's a lighter one. Just, just to tell you, it's a lighter one. 20 mil bottle, 750. 32 mil bottle is 1150. 64 mil bottle is 19 dollars, and 126 milliliters is 32 dollars. Nicotine levels range from 0 0.5, 1, 1 1.5, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, and 24. Okay? Yeah, I go through that quick. Uh, PG, VG, starts at 100% PG and goes down 10% until you get to 20 PG, 80 VG. Then your last option is max VG. Okay? Flavor intensity, this is at normal. I like normal, okay? I like normal. In your face, which is the recommended level, notch up above this. Wow, not recommended for tanks. It may crack them if they're plastic. Or I trust you. All right? All right, all right. And I will throw the links down there. Love it. Now, I don't know. Maybe it's that new cotton. But I get a lot of cotton right now. What happened? What happened? I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm touching the side. It shouldn't be. I mean, this thing is juicy. But it's possible. Anything's possible in vaping. Let's try that. Cranberry mango, huh? Yes, I have had this. I have used it in my Atlantis. I have used it in the Helios. Rush cotton build isn't going over so well. Let's, let's go down. Why not? Let's go down. The cranberry is really light. And it just may be that, uh, you know, I'm at normal flavor for this. And I am used to anything with the name Ocean Spray on it is going to be pow, give you a pucker in face. So, you know, my fault, I guess, for not adding a little bit to that. I'm juicing. It's a light, crisp apple. For some reason, I'm not really getting the mango. But it could be that fresh cotton bill. Let me see something here. Could be that fresh cotton bill. That's pretty dry. Yes, mango splash, mango splash, mango splash. It's probably the fresh cottony build. You know, you gotta kind of break that in a little bit sometimes. Sometimes. Not all the time. I'm not getting much mango out of this.
white cranberry, the hint of crisp apple. That's about it. At normal mode, for the flavor intensity, it's going to be too light for some people. It is a nice mild vape, and it uh, does vape quite nicely. That's always my concern more than anything else, because I like the vapor production. But I'm not getting a lot of mango. The hint of cranberry and the crisp apple, and that's all. Still a very good bait. For those lighter, refreshing vapes. Very nice. Thanks again, Jen. Great customer service over there. I always end up messing up my order in one way or another, and she contacts me or just fixes it for me because she knows. She just knows. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Can I say thank you enough? Mm. Very nice. Very nice indeed. But light at this flavor intensity. Just so you know. Just so you know. Mango Splash. Check it out. Links will be down below as per usual. You all have fun now, because I know I will.